having had the privilege to experience being your shishya and this guru shishya parampara i wanted your wisdom on this very beautiful and loving guru shishya relationship especially in the backdrop of all this new post covid technology world guru vada is a very ancient tradition it's the oldest known system of transmission of knowledge about self knowledge so it has weathered and been able to keep alive after so many 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 centuries if not millennia i think it will handle a little covid incident quite well certainly the guru shishya tradition is very very much also about presence and i had called all my my offerings presence because i felt so strongly the importance of presence today is also the first time that there is a live a video transmission ever because i preferred to just maintain presence and to to do the transmissions in presence certain things are simply not possible when the physical presence is not there very material almost dense material transference of energy and transmission of energy is not possible over these systems and for that one has to be in the physical presence but there is a large part of this transformational process that also can very well happen just by even reading about it or even listening into someone who speaks about it and in a way it also makes for a certain degree of independence and a certain degree of self reliance in times when it's not possible to be in the presence of a teacher one teaches oneself and tries to also you know create that atmosphere of truth basically the teacher is someone who is able to show you your inner guru your master within that is the crux of the story it's about turning your gaze inward and into the presence towards the presence and surrendered into the presence of the inner guru the real final actual guru so if you take that as a as a sadhana and you keep on practicing that at one point also the the external guru is is almost redundant actually and then it's a matter of just because you you love the one that has shown you yourself you maintain that that connection of respect and reverence but the connect is actually with the antar guru and that is also possible in such circumstances not as easy but possible and as i said before certain transmissions can't happen but a lot else can happen so let's focus on what is possible and not on what is not possible